The California Western Railroad was probably not overjoyed when people started calling its train the skunk. But today, it's the bread and butter of this excursion railroad. Chugga, 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 chugga up the hill. Puffin' and chugging, you know that engine will reach the summit and go down. Located in Fort Bragg, California, this powerful steam locomotive pulls passengers into the past. That's old 45. Fired up and ready, she see. There really are engineers licensed to operate steam engines. They ride in the cab along with the firemen. They work together to give passengers a safe and memorable ride. While the age of steam ended many years ago, steam locomotives are alive and well all over the country on excursion railroads, including this one here at Fort Bragg. On this day, we see Boy Scouts on a double adventure, train ride, and summer camp. We're on our own adventure handing our tickets to the conductor and climbing aboard. <laughs> Trackside, we see a water tower, an essential element of steam locomotives. You can't see beyond our train shed, but there used to be a big lumber mill out there, the Union Lumber Company. And we started that here in 1885, and we had a steamship line that transported all those pieces of lumber down to San Francisco where we sold it. Slowly, we eased forward and rolled out of town toward the second growth redwood forest that makes this train ride so special. The large windows provided a great view from the coach, but I was soon in the open car, right out there with the fresh air and trees. It was this redwood forest that gave the railroad its birth. Born to haul logs to build San Francisco back in the 1800s, the trees are growing back, making this train ride a visit to the redwood forest. During lunch, we could see how a steam locomotive works. The cam is moved by the steam-powered piston attached to the wheels to make them turn. We took on more water before the crew prepared to take us back to Fort Bragg. Passengers nodded off in the coach while people like me returned to the open car. This train had a special crew member, a train singer, Greg Schindel, who led us in a familiar train song. I've been working on the railroad one song long. Oh, yes. Bragg. 
spot. Okay, we're about ready to get off, so I will stop. Oh, here's an old train up there. This car we were passing would carry future passengers on this great redwood forest ride. We'd keep the memories of a day well spent.
Thank you.